If you're watching this, I'm dead. Still flourishes in Gotham, lurking in every shadow. You don't need that mask. I know it's you, Rachel Ghoul. You allowed this blasphemy, this sacrilege. Did you think you could keep it from me? <laughs> Parlot Tricks will not save Gotham from its reckoning. Not now! <laughs> This city is still under my protection.
You'll be dead before they get you. Your precious family. I will slaughter them. One by one. And when they have drawn their last breaths, I will burn the city to the ground. You won't get a chance. Gotham is their city now. Watching this, I'm dead. This is a code black. This message was automatically triggered when I destroyed the cave and everything it contained. I know what's coming won't be easy. as best as I can. <laughs> I know you have to. I'm sorry it's come to this. for Gotham's criminals to realize the Batman is gone. And you can't count on the GCPD. Haven't trusted us since Jim died. You are clear to engage. Grenade! I'm leaving you the Belfry as the base of operations. Some of the technology is outdated, but it has the gear you need and all of my files. Many of you knew Bruce from Gotham's celebrity pages. A handsome, charming billionaire. <laughs> and... He was that. But he was more than a headline. He was my nephew. He was a friend, a mentor, and a benefactor to those of us gathered here today. And to those of you who didn't know him as we did, I want to tell you this. Bruce was Gotham. He loved this city more than he loved anything. He was a protector to this city. He worked tirelessly behind the scenes to bring justice 
and equality. There's nothing he wouldn't do. No project he wouldn't champion if he thought Gotham would benefit. And I think in remembering that, we remember Bruce as he truly was. You've always had my back when I needed you. I know you'll keep Gotham safe. Good luck. And goodbye. How's Alfred? What you'd expect. It took him three years to agree to a vacation and Bruce turned up dead. He asked for some time. He knows none of us were there either, right? What about you? You let Jacob Kane give the eulogy. He offered. He thought it'd be easier on us if he was the one to do it. He's Bruce's uncle. Hell of a speech. All that talk about a protector who works behind the scenes. If he only knew. I'm at Gotham U. What's the story so far with this professor? Kirk Langstrom. Judging by the half-finished file with the code black, Batman was digging into him hardcore. Eyes open and ready for anything, then. So we got a positive ID on this faculty dude. Kirk Langstrom. Right. I'll call it in on the way to the morgue. Bad news. Langstrom is dead. Any idea where I can find his office? Langstrom's dead? Oh, hold on. Just checking GU's website. Uh, here we go. His office is on the third floor in Molten Hall. Thank you. The balcony doors are open. That's my way in. Here we go. The cops didn't spend much time here. Langstrom must have died somewhere else. These marks are suspicious. I wonder what made them. All I have is dead end so far. I feel like this might turn into something. You'd like it. I'm breaking into a lab. 
I always did love a good break-in. Even that night you accidentally tripped the alarm? Excuse me, that was you. I'll see if there's anything else to this lead. Stay safe. You too. This is where Langstrom died. You'd think the GCPD would still be all over this lab. Looks like Langstrom was attacked at his workstation. He lost a lot of blood. He tried to get away, and then the attacker pinned him to the wall. Brutal. Langstrom spent his final moments crawling toward that cabinet. Why didn't he try to leave the lab? Holy crap, it's a hidden door. What were you hiding, Dr. Langstrom? Langstrom made specific note of these dates, and now I will too. The thermostat could definitely double as a keypad. That did it. Let's find out what secrets this guy was keeping. Well, this is something. Batman's dead professor was researching some real sketchy stuff. Langstrom's desk. What's this? That's a hard drive. Might have some answers. Better get this back to the Belfry. Hey, I think I'm done here. Cops cleared out quick. Missed some weird marks on the walls, and a hidden lab, with an even more hidden hard drive. Great! Can't wait to get my hands on it. A fire alarm? Did someone see? and all the other gangs have been running wild. Someone ought to teach them a lesson. I'm on it. Gotta stop these freaks from burning this place to the ground. Shut up, fire alarm! Die, die, die! Sweet dreams. Down you go. The average temperature that something lights on fire is between 424. <laughs> out. Hey, look up here! I'm a professor of setting stuff on fire! Congratulations! 
Nice and easy. <laughs> Better to stay hidden. Are the fumes getting to you, buddy? inside. Paramedics are on the way. What's your status? Just a lot going on tonight. I'm head back now with Langstrom's hard drive. Finally. the Belfry now. Hope you guys are ready. Great. It feels like years since I got to analyze some evidence.
Nice work grabbing that drive from Langstrom's lab. Once we can get at the data, we can figure out what our next move is. I'm going out. I'm not gonna sit and wait for... whatever this shit is. We're waiting for intel, Jason. Once we have it, then we'll go. <sighs> move. I'm gonna solve this case my way. He wanted us to work this together. Whatever. That's making this harder than it has to be, kid. I guess, since we're waiting anyway, we might as well take another look at what Bruce had on Langstrom. Crap. That must have been the secondary breaker. The primary went out months ago. I thought the backup would hold. I got it. No need. I've put in a small fix that should hold for a while. Wasn't sure you were coming, Alfred. I'll always be here when you need me, Master Richard. When any of you need me. I'm glad you're here. As am I, Master Tim. This place does need work. Damn it. We've got activity all over the city. Sweet. Looks like my plan wins. Hold up. We still need the intel. And Alfred can't exactly set this place up alone. Indeed, Miss Gordon. I have a list of supplies we'll need. I could do it on my own, but... It would be faster if I had help. You can count on us, Alfred. We'll divvy it up. Let's finish what Bruce started. Hey, Tim. How'd it go at the quarry? Not well. I sweeped the whole place and didn't find anything. No one's been there in ages. How are we supposed to see the full picture when most of the pieces are missing? Bruce left us one hell of a last case. I mean, what kind of person builds a secret lab in their lab? Someone who has something to hide, obviously. But what? What was he trying to make, and who is he hiding it from? Yeah, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Let's wait and see what that hard drive has to tell us first. Right. We'll get some answers soon enough.
we have any idea of what killed Langstrom yet. Hard to say much until these computers are up and running. Or we can examine the body, but for what it's worth... for the GCPD. Makes sneaking into the station a little easier, at least. Guess I can't just ask the front desk where they're keeping Langstrom's body. The morgue's on the far side of the bullpen. Make sure the cops don't see you sneaking around. Goddamn freaks. That's my daughter's school. We got a few in lockup. One caller in interrogation. Is anyone getting that John Doe body? Buff guy, wild outfit. You turn your body cam off right in front of my boy. Do you have any clue what they say about you out there? It's time for you to fall in line and get to the fall in line. Bullshit. I'm good at my job, Commissioner. Jim Gordon? Well, you can't listen to the Eat the student body! Barbecue the rich! Make it spicy! Shut up in there, you freaking nut job! Freaking nut job! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
I swear, cross my ticker. I grew an ear on my shoulder. Shut up or I'm coming in. It fell off and then I ate it. Keep that crap to yourself, weirdo. You still got Betsy? I the piggy took everything. I ain't got no trust left. No Gordon, no Batman. No need for a bat signal. Sneaky in the dark. I see things you don't even know. Now here we are again. We'll get to you with more gas. The morgue's somewhere on the other side of this bullpen. Now would be a particularly bad time to be spotted. Will you stop giving me shit? It's bad enough I'm writing at the desk. We'll release the Langstrom scene quick. The freak showed up. Kind of took the attention. Figures it's locked. Guessing a higher clearance. Someone must have a key. The desk sergeant, perhaps. There you are. Whoa. Did someone knock out the forensics team? Watch your back. Whew. Not dead. Belfry, tell you how cool is here. Copy that. Be careful. You know you can't beat me. My beloved has trained you well. Pretty sure he told you to stay out of Gotham. Dead men's wishes don't concern me. Besides, I'm here to clean up my father's mess. Which in this case is the demon himself. Just burning him? Might be hard to bring Raish back if he's Ash, Talia. Even a Lazarus pit has some limits. Wait. Why was he after Bruce? Ninjas. Langstrom. Hopefully the ME found something. You're looking for... Is this for playing a game online?
Langstrom had some health issues beyond being pinned to a wall. He hid the data in a glucose meter that reads his blood. Ah, Belfry. GCPD just figured out Talia's been here. I need a way out. I'm on it. We'll find you an exit. Be careful. These guys are armed at the teeth. Thankfully, I know my way around the GCPD systems. Sorry to leave you guys in the dark. Ooh, you're good. I'm sneaking out of here. Entrance is secure. Spread out. We'll find the perp. Keep going. They gotta be here somewhere. Belfry, all clear to exit the station. Thanks for the assist. Anytime. Looking forward to seeing what you found. Belfry, the GCPD found me. Ah, do be careful, sir. It really wouldn't do to chip the paint on the bat cycle this quickly. No, we don't want that. Drop your Lab notes, formulas, financial records, research into hearing loss, human experimentation and trials? That looks like cash payouts to volunteers. I recognize some of these jerks. They're all known gang members. So Langstrom was doing medical experiments on criminals. You're crowding me. Miss Gordon. The hollow imaging system is back online as of this morning. Perfect timing, Alfred. Hey, I forgot how sweet your setup was, Babs. It's ancient, but it'll do for now. You and Master Bruce are the only two people in the entire world who would consider the Belfry systems ancient. While researching Langstrom, I also called up all we've got on... our party crasher. Talia Al Ghul. She was a match for Master Bruce in more ways than one. Her presence in Gotham is concerning. So is the fact that she torched her old man's body. We sure that was Ra's al Ghul? His DNA was all over the weapon she left behind. I wonder why she didn't take a chance and use a Lazarus pit to revive him. Well, Batman would just find Talia and ask her himself. Good thinking. Yeah, I can double check Talia's kunai for trace materials that we can track. 
We should also hit the streets. Find out if anyone had any beef with Langstrom. Sweet. Time to bust some skulls. Get over what Talia did to her father's body back there. Good riddance. Going in a Lazarus pit wants his hell. Who knows what a thousand dunk would have done to him. So you think it really was a show of mercy? Oh, she was putting on a show all right. But I doubt it was mercy. Seems like Dr. Langstrom was into some pretty wild... Sometimes I wake up in the middle of the night, expecting Bruce to call me for help. And then I remember. I thought it might have been one of you calling just now. I was worried. Old habits, I suppose. That's why I thought going to Bloodhaven alone would be easier. But it wasn't. I won't be like him, Alfred. Bruce left some big shoes to fill. But I'm gonna do things my way. And I'll be here to support you. Gotham is in good hands. <laughs> 